Hey everyone, welcome back to Siren. Last time, we had gone back to the elementary school, and that was because Reiko had to unlock a door in the gym. She had to unlock the fire exit. And now we're going to find out why. It's because Naoko, sometime later, after getting out of Gajaku Peak, started to wander around and came near the school, and she found the fire exit. And since Reiko was kind enough to have unlocked it, Naoko is now able to get into the school, which I'm sure she will be just thrilled about. So, let's head back to the school, day one, 22 o'clock. So a good deal of time has passed since Reiko and Harumi escaped. The school really needs to get that door fixed. You can open it from the outside, but not the inside, and that does not seem like a great fire escape. Anyway... This does look quite a bit different from when we were here last time. There's like this netting that's been put up. And we can see something moving down there. And just to confirm, no, we cannot leave. We cannot get out that way. We have to find another way of leaving. So it seems like it's a fun time going on in the school after hours. Well, we still have our gun, and we have 16 bullets, so quite a bit of ammo, really. So we're just going to take it calm, going to take it slow, and remember that we have this gun. But what we've got to deal with right now are spider shibito, which are kind of similar to the crawlers that we've seen before, but as you might have noticed... They can crawl up on the walls. Well, they can't seem to get through their web. And that's good for us for right now, so let's head towards the ladder and see if we can get down there. Oh, hold on, that guy's... Yeah, that guy's gonna head towards the bottom of the ladder, because he saw me. And it's gonna be kind of a problem to get down there if he's down there. Oh, you can hit me through there. Never mind, then. Alright, uh, let's see. If that guy's at the bottom of the ladder, I'm probably gonna have to wait him out. Okay, never mind. Alright, so the difficulty going up a little bit. They can't get through the web, but it does seem like they can actually just smack us right through it so i think i'm just going i'm just gonna head, have to head right towards that ladder and hopefully get there before they do because you saw last time we don't have inv invincibility frames when we're climbing down the ladder so they can just hit me when i'm coming down the ho what i hope is that they're not going to be that fast okay they're almost here but i'm already down Let's head on out. We already know the layout of the school, so that's one advantage that we have. That's open. It wasn't open last time. It was locked, but someone unlocked it in the meantime. Let's see what's inside. We've got an archive item.
And there's something down there. We don't have the option to go get it because we can't reach down there. It's covered with those wood planks. But there's something down there. And we probably should remember that. For right now. Alright, 12 bullets left. Let's take a look at our archive item. I mean, that gun has worked very well for Naoko, but she is starting to run a little bit low. Alright, we got a flyer for the Stargazer Circle, a club at the elementary school. It seems that they were going to try to see a comet that visits Earth only once every 333 years. They were going to gather at 8pm to 11.30pm at the school, and I assume that this is the current date. Um... And this would explain why Reiko and Harumi were at the school so late. It seemed kind of odd that they would have been at the elementary school at 2 in the morning, but this is probably why. They were here for the Stargazers Club, looking for that comet, and then they hit midnight, the siren went out, and then problems started. I wonder if they saw that comet. Hopefully they did. Hopefully at least one good thing happened tonight. He wants us to acquire the key. However, when we step out, well, things have been rearranged since the last time we were here. So getting out of the getting out of the school not going to be quite as straightforward as we might have thought. The front door is still boarded up. I mean, you probably expected that. Probably didn't think we were going to get out that easily. And the faculty room has been boarded up too, so we can't get to that open window. So we're going to have to find a key. Naoko doesn't know what this is. She doesn't recognize the symbol, though Reiko did. Of course, Reiko is an inhabitant of the town, while Naoko is an outsider. Anyone around? Let's see, who is this? Where's the... Oh, that's in the gym. Don't have to worry about the gym right now. Yep, let's back up. It looks like someone saw us. Yeah, right there. Was able to one-shot it since we got it from behind. Unexpected. I mean, this is just badly drawn. I mean, this child has no future in art, clearly. Don't need to look in the bathrooms since, hey, we're not looking for a child who might be hiding in there. This door is locked. We have no key. We cannot unlock it. Let's head to the second floor. And let's try to sight jack so we can see who might be up here. Yeah, that's getting up already. So that did not stay down that long. Alright, there's someone in the hallway. Someone low to the ground. There's someone on the wall. Uh, that's in the library, I think. Yeah, someone else in the library. Now, do you hear that sound? That's the sound of a brain, Shibito. If we take the brain out, Everyone else is going to fall over unconscious, so that's a way to save some ammo. Alright, that guy can see us, but I'm just going to duck in here and close this door. Oh, it's <laughs> coming right through the other door. I thought I was being all clever. But that other door was open, and you can see the flashlight right there. That is the brain. Gonna try to sneak up. Then we're gonna go running. And it's gonna go running, because that's what brains do. Whoop, oh, hold on. Oh, look who it is. It's the principal. He's looking different than he did before. He's got, like, little tentacles coming out of his head. And if you heard that, all of the other spiders in this level, they've now, they've now fallen over. 
unconscious. Everyone in the level has, because the brain has been taken out. I suppose it's not a surprise that the principal of a school became a brain shibito. Well, we got a pair of compass, and it kind of looks like a big uh, pincer, right? Seems like something you might be able to grab something with. Something that might be in a narrow place. So maybe we should hurry up and get back down to the first floor before everyone starts getting back up. And see if we can find what was underneath those planks. Starting to slow down. The characters in Siren, not a whole lot of stamina, as I've mentioned before. All right, let's see what we can find. That is some really precise key grabbing on the part of Naoko. Oh, we still have a library card. It's for this school. We don't have any need for it right now, though. We may need it a little later, I believe for the second objective of this level, but for right now, we don't need to worry about that. We didn't need to go into the uh, library at all, really. Because we have this uh, key to the small storage room. It opens the small storage room next to the stairs on the first floor. Now, that door was locked. We know where the stairs are, so we're going to head back. And that's not too far away. It's just one spider that might be in the way. Oh, hold on. That's the brain. That's the principal. You can tell because of the sound. And he is looking at the bathrooms, which means he is standing on the stairs. Alright, so he's going to be to our left as we try to come out of here. And there might be one spider that has gotten back up. Yep, there certainly is. More aggressive this time. Oh, can I not reload? Yeah, I only have four bullets left in total. So, this gun has served us well, but it looks like it is almost done. It's almost done. But I should have enough bullets to take out the principal. He is... No, he's not there? Alright. Well, I mean, if he went, if he wandered off, that's, that's alright with me. Just curious, where did he go? I probably shouldn't bother with this, but I'm just kind of curious as to where he went. Alright, he's... I think he went up to the second floor and he's wandering up there. I mean, again, that's fine for me, because if he stood on those stairs, I was going to have to take him out before coming in here. As it is, we can just walk on out. I did it! <laughs> Mission accomplished. So we have left the school. And we'll have a second objective there, but not quite yet. So Naoko, um, she seems to be doing okay, but she might have a problem coming up because her gun is almost out of ammo. And without that, she is going to have issues. But uh, we're not going to follow Naoko as she leaves the school quite yet. I think next up is going to be Shiro, because before we had the option of going with either Kiyoya, Tamen, or Shiro. And I believe we have now exhausted the pathways that we have uh, by picking Kiyoya or Tamen. So we are going to head to Shiro. We're going to go back to, I believe, Shiro's first mission as he wakes up in the middle of a forest, in the middle of uh, some hills after the siren went off, and he's just very confused as to what is going on. Maybe his second objective will shed some light on that. Or maybe not. 
we'll see what happens next time as we play some more Siren and we continue to go through this uh, survival horror game that is all about survival. It's completely about that. We haven't gotten much story yet at all. We've gotten some story, bits and pieces through some small cutscenes and some archive items, but really not much at all. But as we go forward, we'll slowly piece things together and work out what's going on as we continue on into day... Well, I shouldn't say into day two of Siren, because we still will have some second objectives in day one. But I think that as we, as we go forward, we're going to start to get more day two missions in which things will start changing pretty dramatically. But until we get to that, we'll keep going on, and I'll see you next time as we head back with Shiro. That says Kiyoya, but we're not going to go with Kiyoya, because that particular mission, we already did the, uh, no, actually the second objective is not available yet for that particular mission. We're not going to do that. Don't believe what the save file says. We're going to do Shiro, not Kiyoya. I'll see you then for that.